Can you read your mistake? Please. Ye eat amsels of Castalia, of Melpamine and Thalia, extenuate an alien that languishes in woe. Dan Cupid has surprised me, waylaid and pauperized me, way the sea martyrized me, is what I wish to know. Exiled in that first city, a paragon of pity. I look at bright my deity and catalog to tell of the beauties of that matron, my connoisseur and patron, that consort fit. For Satan, the star of Sunday's well, expressly fabricated for to be venerated. Her weight is estimated at fully 19 stone. The undulating ocean recalls her vagrant motion. Magnanimous devotion, I render her alone. She's blooming and she's bonny with real estate and money. A floweret filled with honey in her soft serpentel. And I, the big Osaurin. Around her bower adoring the beauty and the store of the star of Sunday's well. This matron subsidizes both the beamishes and the wises. The buyance that she prizes provides most comely fare. I wish I could administer. A modicum of Guinness to her, for there is nothing sinister or medieval there. Her heart I would allure it, but that a grouse's curate is planning to secure it by arts of vices fell. I have given hints abundant. To that obscure incumbent, to flutter less redundant round the star of Sunday's well. All through the summer weather, two lovers linked together, patrolled marina's heather, or strolled along the dike. <laughs> the blackbirds and the thrushes. Established in the bushes, their religions in rushes propelled to carry pike. I heard the joking rhymester and sighed as for his cloister. Uh, quaint but fulsome meister, like a hermit in his cell. For I lacked reciprocation in this matron's cogitation. For I got a harsh negation from the star of Sunday's well. Thanks for your